Okay, guys, we're going to see if we can do this. Uh, phone's having issues. I'm trying to do this on the SD card. Welcome back. Um, we have deleted and deleted and deleted, and it's still saying uh, storage issues, so it's cutting the videos off. I do apologize. Uh, had this issue before. We will get it fixed. Um, and here's another view of the animals here. Um, let the chickens out, as you can see in the previous video. So, uh, what I want to discuss with you now, um, we're waiting on Lowe's to bring us our, uh, what we want. And uh, we will disclose that after they get here. But uh, a lot of you may be wondering, what are our goals for the new year? Well, I don't really set goals for the year um, because I never know what's going to happen. Um, it is such a letdown when you don't meet uh, your goals. Uh, you're literally setting a requirement for yourself. And, uh, well, sometimes we just can't meet those goals. And, you know, that, that's a bummer. Um, we do plan for things. Uh, we try to do what we can, and that's what we're going to do this year. Um, last year was a absolute bust. Um, you know, there was a thing on Facebook asking to describe <laughs> last year in one word. Well, last year was a loss. Um, not just for us. I feel like it was a loss for us uh, as a nation. And... Uh, you know, everybody, everybody struggled to get through, and, uh, you know, sometimes you win and sometimes you lose, and, uh, you know, a lot of great things were able to happen, yes, that's a positive, but, uh, you know, <laughs> this last year, uh, especially for us, was one of the hardest that we have been through, um, absolutely miserable, um, Yes, I am a, a Trump fan because uh, life was way easier when he was in office. And, uh, you know, I'm not going to get into a political debate about that. Um, it's been absolutely miserable uh, since this new president took over. So, uh, not going to get into a lot of political things on my channel. Uh, we are not going to make goals for this year. Uh, we are going to get done what we can get done. Um, there's a lot of things on the to-do list. So, uh, you know, we'll leave that as, as our goals. Um, you know, a lot of people make short-term goals. Some people make long-term goals. We just have goals. And um, we'll get them done as we get them done. Um you know, some of the things that I know we're going to get done is getting that camper cleaned up. And, uh, you know, I'll have a trailer frame to work with. Um, I plan on starting on the mobile home. Um, getting it taken care of and out of here. And, uh, you know, we are wanting to pay this place off and relieve one of our debts. Um... You know, that would make it a lot easier on us. Um, we are going to uh, to add a horse. You know, that, that's been a, a big goal. Um, we're going to check that off. Uh, can't wait to get the baby home. Um, he's beautiful. And, uh, you know, that's, that's a huge relief. And... Um, we can't wait for it. We're going to do what we have to do to make that happen. Um, I go pick up the trailer tomorrow evening. And uh, I'll be leaving out really early Wednesday morning. Um, I don't know what time I will be back. I'm not sure how much of that I'll be able to film. Um, you know, I film on my phone. So, uh, you know, being able to edit out... Uh, 
you know, a 10 hour day is a little bit difficult and I definitely can't record that long. So, um, I will probably get you guys a glimpse and, uh, we will just record when we get back and, uh, I'll let you guys see him. Um, I wish that, uh, you know, things were different and I could record more and, and get more of that footage, but, uh, it is what it is. We're going to deal with it, and, uh, you guys aren't going to miss a thing. Um, uh, you'll be able to see him and enjoy him just as much as, as I will. Um, a video on that day may be short, because I've got to, uh, drop him off and try to return the trailer, uh, to the rental company, uh, because I'm not taking my trailer, um. It's an open back. We're dealing with a wild horse, and uh, you know I've I've had some light issues and and things that I just don't want to risk uh, running into any problems during this trip. So we're just going to rent a trailer, cut out any any possibilities, and uh, you know our trailer works wonderful for local trips and and things like that. So uh, you know I'm not going to risk a precious life like that um that long of a trip uh you know my trailer needs a lot of help i'm hoping to get a different trailer um in the future uh we'll have to see how that plays out uh if if we can do so we're wanting to try to get a piece of equipment but uh you know we've got a lot of priorities we've got to mark off our list you know, things for the house, uh, you know, my wife's car is not in the best health. Um, you know, she, uh, she has to take a truck a lot and I need the truck, um, you know, a lot because there's a lot to do around here and without a piece of equipment, well, that's, that's my go-to piece of equipment to get things done around here. So, uh, you know, there, there's a lot of, a lot of priorities, um, you know, and we have to pick and choose. Hi, Bubba. We have to pick and choose uh, what we're going to do. Um, that's why I just don't, uh, I don't set goals. We're on a budget. We get things done as we get them done. And, uh, you know, they don't get marked off the list until they're done. So, uh, never-ending goals. I don't know what you want to call it, but, uh, you know, I'm... My biggest goal is to try to have a better year than the one before. And uh, we'll get done what we get done, guys. Uh, so we're wanting, to, you know, to do a different fencing around this whole place so we can let more animals roam. And, uh, you know, just, just let everybody have their freedom. And um, I don't know if that'll happen. I'm not going to make it a goal, because if it doesn't happen, I know it'll happen uh, eventually. So, uh, you know, we have priorities, and uh, that's how we're going to do this new year. Um, like I said, we've got a lot accomplished. Um, we were able to... Uh, get this camper tore down we're getting a lot of scrap hauled out of here so uh you know this camper is not just gonna sit here and rot in the yard and uh you know i'll be able to move that trailer anywhere i want to on the property and not have to worry about it um that camper was ridiculously heavy and uh you know bulky and all that so you know finding a place to put it's kind of a little bit difficult um the mobile home, I don't know yet if we're just, maybe we'll try to sell it, maybe we'll tear it down. Um, I am more on the tearing it down and just getting it out of here. Um, can reuse the frame, could sell the frame, there, there's a lot of options here. There's a lot of metal on there that I could reuse for animal shelters. Um, Freya! Quit being a butt. Quit being in trouble. Come on. Hang on. She may she may want to play some fetch. Let's see if we can find a stick. Because I'm not going to tread through the mud to find 
her fetch stick. We do have a fetch stick. You want a stick? Here, guys, let's let's give you some footage here. She uh, she absolutely goes wild over sticks. Let's go down here where it's open. Let's go. Let's calm down. Patience. 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 Okay, guys. Let's play some fetch. Let's see how far I can throw it this time. Ready, guys? We all. That wasn't too far. Release. Good girl. All right. Hold on, guys. You might go a little wonky. Oh, we hit the tree this time. I can usually throw pretty far. I can get her. Uh, I can get her stick pretty far out there. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't grab her stick. And this one's a little bit lighter. Release. Good girl. Well, if I could stay out of the tree. <laughs> Poor girl. She. Uh, it's over here, baby. It's over here. Right there. Hey. Right, yeah, right there. There you go. She's usually pretty good at finding them. Uh, guys, she would pick up this big four, uh, garden timber, you know, four by four. And uh, she would lug the thing around. I mean, she just, she loves sticks, and it doesn't matter what size they are. Uh, she's just got immaculate strength. Uh, but, uh, we do keep her in the house now. We keep Dodger in the house, uh, just because it's wintertime. I haven't had a whole lot of time to do their structures. And, uh, you know, making it safe uh, for them to be outside this time of year. So, uh, they are... Kept in the house. Um, Freya is now in our closet instead of a kennel. Uh, she's doing much better there. Uh, Dodger stays in a kennel. Um, as well as Little Lady and the uh, the other puppy. We let them out uh, in the house as well as outdoors. So they can go potty outside. And uh, they love it. Uh, they they get their exercise in for sure they get the social time in um, I've never been a keep a dog in a kennel or keep a dog tied up but sometimes we just have to do what we don't like to do and uh, it's for the the best benefit of them I mean she is a happy happy dog so uh, I guess if you want to look at it, it as uh, as goals, guys, we're going to get that hauled out of here. Not all of that was on this property. Uh, all of the machines, some of them were ours. Some of them I went and helped a friend clean up her backyard. And the rest of this, the bed springs and stuff like that, um, came out of the berm pile. Um... A lot of that was already in there. Some of it was from us, um, again, cleaning up for a friend. Um, we have a lot more to burn around here. Uh, we have a lot more scrap to clean up around here. There's a bunch of stuff buried through here um, that we have to get hauled up here up this hill. It's not a steep hill by any means, um, but it's just working around all this stuff and trying to get it up out of there to get it loaded. Uh, we actually discovered a full transmission down here as well as that big furnace. That is an old, old furnace. Uh, we're estimating it to be in the 30s, 40s range. Um, there's still some stuff down in here. I mean, just it's literally having to dig it out. So um, we have some fence in here. I'm wanting to get pulled up because somebody had made apparently fencing pins, or I I don't know exactly what the deal was, but there's fence that runs not on the property line, and uh, 
well a lot of it's down on the ground um, so that has been a chore uh, trying to track all that down we're also looking at getting some equipment in here to take care of that because we need to clear the fence line um, so we can get the fence line where it needs to be and as well as put up uh, a different style of fence uh, we're gonna go with a field fence uh, it is the cheaper option but it should keep in our animals and then on top of the field fence we're gonna do uh, a strand or two of the high tinsel um, that should keep everybody in um, there's never a guarantee of that uh, anybody that has a homestead or a farm knows that there's never a guarantee that the animals will not escape um, with horses cattle if they want to get out they're going to get out now you can make it challenging for emu and pigs and chickens um, but if they want out they're going to get out they're going to find a way um, just the way it is and uh, you know we deal with it as we can and don't get me wrong this emu pen is perfect size for them um, it's worked great we've had a few issues here and there but uh, you know we've worked through it we figured it out and uh, you know it, it works it's been uh, fantastic this guy absolutely loves me loves attention he loves all of us. He'll actually lift the kids up on his head. Uh, he's just been a, a fantastic addition to our house, uh, to our family. Um, he loves, loves the kids. Loves all of us. Um, he's a fantastic horse. Fantastic. Um, I can't wait to ride him again. Just haven't had much time. Uh, another plan or slash goal is to get some trees and stuff cleared up back here this summer um, just to uh, open that up a little bit get some more grass growing over here uh, I know all the grass over here will come back but I want ooh <laughs> he's not liking Miss Freya taking the attention here. Um, come over here, baby. Yeah, okay. Now Dylan says it's time for him to have attention, so let's just uh, not push buttons here. You're all right, big boy. You're all right, buddy. You gotta. Well, we're gonna have to get that looked at. That's a weird. He's got a weird lump in his chest, or uh, throat, neck. Neck, let's get it. Stop, you're getting me filthy. Anyway, we want more grass to be able to grow over here than what Artie does. Um, that's going to be a goal. So hopefully, the weather warms up a little bit. I'll probably be out there a little bit this winter, um, cutting some stuff down. We will burn it in our stove. Uh, not picky. Wood burns. Green or seasoned. Either way. Um, well, we're just going to continue working on this place, guys. That is, our, that is our goal. Whether it's this year or next year or five years from now. Getting this place cleaned up. Getting it functional. That is our goal. Um, whatever happens in between there happens. We will deal with it. Um, this is a huge thing for me. I want to get this cleaned up. Uh, Freya, no! Um, normally don't have a problem with her chasing the chickens. I think she's just bored. Uh, we're going to put her in the house so we don't have any more uh, casualties. Freya, come! Um, while we're here, guys, uh, don't mind the trash can here. 
this is how this set up so I had to put a new floor in we have new shelves put in and uh, it's uh, it's working fantastic for now um, we have a floor it's a functional house it may not be pretty but it's functional and that's what matters because uh, eventually it'll be what we want it to be um, you know right now we need to have a safe place to live a roof over our head and uh, that's all that matters so uh, you know criticize what you want uh, it's a home so we're making the best of it and uh, waiting on this delivery uh, it's kind of weird to have it on New Year's being a holiday but um, that's what the phone call said so we're waiting on them to get here kind of excited uh, you know we don't win very often but you know doesn't keep us from trying uh, we don't gamble by any means it's, uh, honestly, I don't care. Put my name in there, I win or I don't. You know, I didn't pay for it, so. Uh, winning is awesome. It's exciting. So, uh, that's a good way to start out the new year, is, uh, you know, winning. So, uh, that being said, guys, that's, that's our, uh, you know, our new year, uh, goals, um, is just keep doing what we're doing. Um, we will eventually get there. Um, I think I've covered everything. So uh, we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. If you want to keep up with our future content, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Again, guys, thank you very much. I hope you had a wonderful New Year's, and we will catch you next time.